Well, fellow wizards, my story last left off where I was on my way to the big city with my new wizard powers. However, well, I got a little bit lost. Or rather, a lot bit lost. Perhaps I should have taken a left turn at the end of the old farm road. Anyhow, I was tired and hungry and, well, probably near death. And I didn't know where to go. Along my path, I came across a bear. And I seemed to startle the bear as he turned and ran off. However, after a moment of hesitation, the bear turned back and with his little brain thought, considered turning back and investigating just a little bit more. I too began to approach just a little bit closer. The bear wanted to investigate. However, he was getting a little bit too close for my own comfort. I was getting scared. I wasn't sure what to do, so I waved my wand and I cast a spell. And I turned him into a human. I didn't expect to turn him into a human, but that's just the way magic goes sometimes. I decided to give him a cool wizard hat and some human shoes. And he told me he could help me find the big city. So I climbed on his back and away we were. With his half human, half bear strength, we are away with quickness and agility. He could run for miles without getting tired or navigate the rough terrain. With his super bare sense of smell, he was able to tell right which way to go. We stopped by the river for a quick drink of cool river water, and away we went, down river on our way to the big city. navigated the treacherous rapids. We leaped over the highest mountains. We came near the edge of a fiery volcano. We crossed over icy glaciers. And we braved the scorching deserts. Until we finally came to the big city. <laughs> It's like a starfish. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Into the water! <laughs> I feel like a sea turtle being born! <laughs> 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 